Thieves strike again. It's not the first time this Cameron County man has had problems protecting his land. He wants to know who keeps damaging his property. Channel 5 Stephen Saravia standing by live with more. Stephen. That's right. Robert Martinez owns a piece of land just off Military Highway, and while there isn't much on the land, he's beefing up security to protect what's left. A bi weekly routine cut short. When I went over there to, to open the gate to cut the grass, the, the gate fell by itself. Robert Martinez found pieces of his fence, the thing protecting his property, completely gone. A site similar to last year. I couldn't even believe it myself. Last spring, we reported how Martinez went through the same thing on his land. But last time, they took more than just part of the fence. They also took metal pipes, which he kept on the property. I would say a bean stick, very heavy. Martinez says he couldn't think of any reason to steal a fence other than to sell the metal scraps. One of the things Martinez is doing differently this time around is adding these chains across his property, making it more difficult to get inside. They couldn't take it all apart. He also added more lights to keep the area well lit at night. And he isn't the only target. A few weeks ago, Martinez says his neighbor's property was also hit by thieves. No trailer, no nothing. They took everything. Martinez says he doesn't care if he gets his fence back. He just wants his area to feel safer. We spoke with the Cameron County Precinct 5 Constable Eddie Solis. He tells us during the day they have roughly two constable deputies patrolling their entire precinct. And if they can't patrol an area, they regularly work with the sheriffs. Here, just anybody who wants to increase patrols to call the number on the bottom of your screen. Live in Sub Control, Stephen Sarabia, Channel 5 News at 6.